हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम हम हैं आपके होस्ट आपके दोस्त रॉय यह है दोस्तों हमारी um, सवाल जवाब प्रेजेंटेशन नंबर एट फ्रॉम इस राइजिंग पल प्रेजेंटेशन आज है दोस्तों हमारी सवाल जवाब प्रेजेंटेशन नंबर एट ऑन सीरीज टू पॉलिनोमियल्स नाउ आपको मालूम है दोस्तों हमने जो uh, सवाल जवाब प्रेजेंटेशन नंबर सेवन थी वी टॉक्ट अबाउट अप्लाइंग रिमाइंडर थियोरम विच वॉज आर पार्ट वन ऑफ टू सो so, वहाँ पे दोस्तों हमने डिस्कस की थी हाउ यू कैन अप्लाई रिमाइंडर थ्योरम व्हाट काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चंस यू विल बी गेटिंग बट दोज वेर मोर सिंपलर क्वेश्चन सिंपलर टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चंस आज दोस्तों पार्ट टू जहाँ पे विल टॉक अबाउट लिटिल बिट मोर एडवांस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चंस दैट यू विल बी गेटिंग ऑन दिस पर्टिकुलर टॉपिक नाउ लाइक वी डिट लास्ट टाइम दोस्तों वी विल स्टार्ट बाय डिस्कसिंग वॉट इज अ रिमाइंडर थियोरम सो रिमाइंडर थियोरम स्टेट दैट अगर आपको एक पॉलिनोमियल दी जाती है पी एक्स सच दैट इट इज ऑफ एनी डिग्री ग्रेटर देन और इक्वल टू वन ठीक है एंड मान लीजिए ए इज एनी रियल नंबर देन अगर इफ यू डिवाइड द पॉलिनोमियल पी एक्स बाय अ लिनियर पॉलिनोमियल एक्स माइनस ए अगर आप ऐसा करते हो देन रिमाइंडर विल बी गिवन बाय द वैल्यू ऑफ पॉलिनोमियल पी एट एक्स इक्वल टू ए ये है दोस्तों बेसिकली व्हाट द रिमाइंडर थियोरम इज ऑल अबाउट नाउ इसका मतलब ये हो दोस्तों लेट एस सी हाउ वी कैन अप्लाई दिस सो इसका मतलब ये हो दोस्तों कि अगर आपको एक पॉलिनोमियल दी जाती है पी एक्स सच दैट वी हैव टू मेक श्योर डिग्री ग्रेटर देन इक्वल टू वन सो चलिए वी विल राइट समथिंग एज मान लीजिए एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस टू एक्स प्लस फाइव इफ यू राइट ए पॉलिनोमियल लाइक दिस एंड इस पॉलिनोमियल को अगर मान लीजिए हम डिवाइड करते हैं बाई ए पॉलिनोमियल जी एक्स विच इज मान लीजिए समथिंग लाइक एक्स माइनस टू सो अगर हम इफ यू डू दिस डिविजन देन वेन यू डू पी एक्स डिवाइडेड बाई जी एक्स वो जो रिमाइंडर होगी आर लेट एस कॉल इट आर सो दैट टू फाइंड आउट दैट ना हमने देखिए दोस्तों पहले कि हाउ वी डू द लॉन्ग डिविजन राइट हाउ डू यू डिवाइड टू पॉलिनोमियल्स बट इंस्टेड ऑफ डूइंग द एक्चुअल लॉन्ग डिविजन um what the remainder theorem is telling us is simply if you find out the value of uh, polynomial p at x equal to 2 this will give you the remainder matlab ki if if we find out p2 which is value of polynomial p at x equal to 2 and humne dosto hamare uh, earlier presentations mein we have seen how to find out the value of a polynomial at a value of variable so the remainder theorem is telling ki agar aap if you find out the value of p at x equal to 2 this gives us the, the remainder now similarly dosto aapko malum hai the let's say agar if you would have uh, taken something like px equal to man lijiye uh, 5 and we are writing some random polynomials here um 2x square plus 30x minus 10 agar ye hamari px hoti and agar we would have taken a gx of a, again the gx has to be a linear polynomial we will do let's say x plus 10 so then we have to to find out the the remainder when px is divided by gx the remainder will be again to find out we have to find out the value of polynomial at if you have it in this format we have to find out the value of the polynomial px at x equal to minus 10 now dosto we have in our um, sawal jawab presentation number 7 mein we have actually taken a extensive look at different kind of divisors so iska matlab ye ho dosto ki we have seen ye jo gx hai aapki right agar agar gx agar gx if it is of the form maan lijiye x minus a this is the most uh, straight forward form but what if if you have gx as x plus a right or if you have your gx as um maan lijiye a fraction or if you have your gx as um, something like maan lijiye of this nature right so hamari jo presentation 7 thi we have seen all of these combinations in that so aaj dosto what we will talk about is that aap notice karoge in each of these various cases jo humne ab tak uh, handle ki hai last uh, presentation mein the coefficient of this term x has always been 1 सो so, आप इस एग्जाम्पल को देखिए यहाँ पे कोफिशियंट ऑफ एक्स इज वन राइट इन दिस एग्जाम्पल अगर दिस इज अ डिविजर कोफिशियंट ऑफ एक्स इज अगेन वन यहाँ पे कोफिशियंट ऑफ एक्स इज अगेन वन एंड यहाँ पे कोफिशियंट ऑफ एक्स इज अगेन वन सो आज दोस्तों वॉट वी विल डू इज वी विल टेक सम ऑफ द मोर वी विल 
we will take some examples we will have a different coefficient of x other than 1. So the type of question also will be uh, the same. So in this case, applying remainder theorem, find the, the remainder when px is divided by gx. polynomial In this case, this is your px. This is your px. And uh, this is your gx, right? So you have given uh, two polynomials, px and gx. And apply the remainder theorem, find out the remainder. Now notice karoke dosta in this example humne intentionally we have taken a, a, a coefficient of x which is not 1 in our linear polynomial the gx your divisor hai. so now how are you going to find out the the remainder right so those are the way we have to do that is first step is we find out the zero of this polynomial so hamare yaha pe we have got gx equal to 3x plus 1 right so the first thing that the first thing that we have to do is we have to find out the zero of this polynomial px 3x plus 1 hai, we have to find out the zero of this polynomial now apne dekha hai dosto from um, the the presentations where we discussed ki kaise karke we have to find zeros of a polynomial so what we do is we equate the polynomial to zero right and then we solve for the variable so agar hamari 3x plus 1 zero hoti hai so this implies we will take the 1 on the other side then we will get 3x equal to when 1 goes to the other side sign change ho jayegi it will become minus 1 right and then this implies uske baad we will divide both sides by 3 so we will get x equal to minus 1 by 3 so humne dekha dosto ki ye jo hamari um, gx hai the divisor the zero of this polynomial is x equal to minus 1 by 3 now our second step is second step is abhi to find out the 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 remainder if px is divided by gx so remainder nikalne ke liye for px divided by gx what we have to do is we have to find out the value of the polynomial at now minus 1 by 3 Iska matlab ye ho dosto ki hamari jo linear polynomial hai uh, the in this case 3x plus 1 iski zero of this polynomial is given at x equal to minus 1 by 3. So abhi ye jo px divided by gx hai uske remainder dhoonne ke liye we have to find out the value of polynomial px at x equal to minus 1 by 3 at the zero of the the divisor. So I tell you now so we will uh, find out. So now so all we have to do is now we have to find out the value of polynomial p at x equal to minus 1 by 3. We have seen from uh, prior episodes how we find out the value of the polynomial at a particular value of the variable. So we have the polynomial given as 6x squared. So wherever we have the variable x we will basically replace this value. right? 6x squared minus 13x minus 13 x ke jaga again we write minus 1 by 3 minus 5 chale hai dosto ab ise solve karte hain so minus 1 by 3 times minus 1 by 3 so minus minus will become plus and then it will become 1 by 9 so pehli term ban gai 6 multiply by 1 by 9 now second term have ki minus 13 times minus 1 by 3 so minus minus will become plus it will become 13 by 3 minus 5 now this will be equal to so now 3 2s are 6 and 3 3s are 9 so this first term will become 2 by 3 plus 13 by 3 minus 5 then agar aap ye pehle do terms ko lete ho you will get 3 is your common uh, denominator and you will get 2 plus 13 2 plus 13 minus 5 and then 2 plus 13 is actually 15 by 3 minus 5 so 3 5s are 15 
So this basically gives you 5 minus 5, which is equal to 0. So, friends, we have seen how to do it. If you have to divide this example, if you, px, if you have to divide this by gx, but gx is given in such a way that the coefficient is not equal to uh, 1, then the step, first step is we actually find out the 0 of the polynomial. This is a linear polynomial. Hai. Uski, you find out the 0. And whatever the value you get, you have to find out the value of the polynomial at that particular value. Now, agar aap dosto, if you think about it, um, this also is true for the very basic uh, format, right? Because if you see what our example was here, in this case, agar if I tell you to find out the 0 of this polynomial, how, how much will it be? You will see this as x minus a. If you have to 0 of this, then you will say x minus a is equal to 0 and then x will be equal to a, right? So, this means that even in, in this very, um, very basic definition, hai, if you think about it, here we see that if our polynomial is of x minus a format and then we, we find out the value of uh, this polynomial uh, when the zero of this polynomial, so which is given by x equal to a, x equal to a, and then we find out the remainder is given by p a, right? So uh, that is the value of polynomial p at x equal to a. Now, chale, so now let us go back and we'll take one more example now. Now this time we have, uh, so this is the second type jahan pe you will be said, find the remainder when px is divided by gx. So directly, agar aapko aise karke kaha jai, find out the remainder when you have a variable given um, as px like this and a variable given as uh, or, or a divisor given uh, in this fashion. So, if you have a question directly, ki, find the remainder when px is divided by gx and, and then you see that the gx it is of degree 1. So, you have two choices. At this point, you can go ahead with a long division. जो हमने हमारे पिछले वेबिसोर्स में वी हैव सीन इट कि कैसे करके लॉन्ग डिवीजन करते हैं वी हैव सीन लॉट ऑफ एग्जांपल्स ऑफ लॉन्ग डिवीजन एज वेल और यू कैन गो हेड एंड अप्लाई द रिमाइंडर थ्योरम बिकॉज़ आई नोटिस कि जो क्वेश्चन में दे आर नॉट आस्किंग यू स्पेसिफाइंग यू कि डू यू वांट टू यूज द रिमाइंडर थ्योरम और यू वांट टू यूज लॉन्ग डिवीजन आपसे सिर्फ पूछा गया है कि फाइंड द रिमाइंडर सो यू कैन गो ईदर वे बिकॉज़ वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट रिमाइंडर थ्योरम इन दिस प्रेजेंटेशन सो वी विल सॉल्व दिस यूजिंग द रिमाइंडर थ्योरम so, we notice that the coefficient of x is not 1. So, what we will do is we will find out the 0 of this uh, polynomial. So, we will take uh, minus 5x plus 2. Uh, isko we will equate it to 0. This implies abhi we will take the 2 on the other side. So, sign will change. It will become minus 2. So, we will get minus 5x is equal to minus 2. And then the minus will cancel out on both sides. And then we will divide both sides by 5. So we will get x is equal to 2 by 5. So this means that the 0 of this polynomial minus 5x plus 2 is 2 by 5. So now what we will do is to find out the, the remainder of um, this division. That is px by gx is division ki jo remainder hai um, so to find that let's call it r so r so now what we have to do is we have to find out the value of the polynomial p at 2 by 5 right so the the remainder will be given by p 2 by 5 so i actually let us do this so hamari uh, polynomial is minus 5x square so we write minus 5 x square x ke jaga we put 2 by 5 square plus 32x x ke jaga we again put 2 by 5 minus 12 now we will solve this Chali, let us solve this so now 2 2 by 5 times 2 by 5 so we will have something like Chale, let us write this first, minus 5, multiply by 2 by 5 times 2 by 5, right? Second term is plus, 
now if you multiply 32 times 2 by 5 so you have to multiply this so 32 times 2 is 2 2 is a 4 2 3 is a 6 this will be 64 divided by 5 and we will have minus 12 now you have first time also so you have a 5 and a 5 this can get cancelled out so then we will get minus 2 times 2 is 4 by 5 so your first term will become minus 4 by 5 plus 64 by 5 minus 12 now what we will do this time is we will take um, Agar now if you have to do the LCM of this 5, 5 and you have 1 here so the LCM will be 5 so the first term is minus 4 second term is plus 64 and third term is 1 5s are 5 so 12 5s are 60 minus 60 so aap notice karo ge, so 64 minus 60 minus 4 so minus 60 minus 4 combine karne se you will get minus 64 divided by 5 so this is basically 0 so 0 by 5 is 0 so I'm going to see how we actually get the, the remainder when we divide px by gx